his decision to appoint a black woman to the Supreme Court is literally going to change the face of the court for the future and for our history in the United States. We understand that responsibility. We shared with him some of our recommendations, uh, but mainly the message was we trust your judgment, Joe Biden, when it comes to choosing the right person. We're going to work as hard as we can to make sure that selection is chosen officially by the Senate as quickly as possible. I would like to add how critical it is for so many of us who are people of color to see a woman who it will be completely qualified to be on the Supreme Court to reflect the diversity of our country, which uh, we need to add to the Supreme Court, I'd say, and this woman is going to do it. I just hear from so many of my friends who say, this means something right here. And I thank the President. As members of the Senate Judiciary Committee, we just had a great conversation uh, led by current Chairman Durbin, um, former Chairman Leahy, and former Chairman Biden. Uh, a great conversation with our president about the factors he's going to be weighing. Uh, one of them that we discussed was someone in the model um, of uh, Justice Breyer, someone who will write stirring, compelling, lasting arguments hopefully in the majority at some point, but probably in the coming few years in the dissent, but someone who is persuasive. We're equally excited that there is no shortage of candidates under consideration that, number one, are abundantly qualified for the job and, in my opinion, are even stronger in their potential given the added life and professional experience that they would bring to the deliberations of the Supreme Court.